pulled up. We just, we just pulled up. What's up? What's up, gang? What's up, man? It's Mr. C. Marty in the building. What's up, man? Let's run this one country. Hey, let's get it. Hey, look. Hey, look, we out here. We at Gold's Gym. We about to get us a good workout in. Some legs. You said what you say? Legs and hamstrings? Legs and hamstrings. I had some legs today. I always need a workout partner, so got my partner with me. We about to get it. Hey, man, look, man. I know you on your, uh, what you say, husky season shit? I know you on your husky season shit, man. Don't try to kill me, man. I'm trying to make my way back, man. I mean, this nigga, he, he really, he really laughing at me. Look, look at him. Look at this. Man, he really laughing at me. Hey, look, y'all. Hey, look, make sure y'all got a uh, 911 on speed dial, man. He trying, he trying to kill me. Stay tuned, it's gonna be some good content. Man, I gotta get a little pre-workout in my system for this one. I can't have the boy show me up. I can't have the boy, huh? I can't have the boy show me up too bad, man. We gotta have a good showing out here. Okay, so first up we have rack pulls. Now, this is a variant of deadlifts. I'm not a big fan of deadlifts, um, just because in doing deadlifts over the years, I sustained a back injury. This is a great way to kind of get a similar effect of deadlifts, but without as much of the risk. We went moderately heavy, too heavy. Um, I definitely would, I definitely would suggest that you warm up before jumping right into doing these heavy, just to make sure that it's not putting too much of a strain on your back. Everything was going well, and then all of a sudden my camera died. So if you notice a change in quality, that's because I switched over to my phone because I was not about to allow this workout to not be captured. But yeah, my camera died. My other battery was dead because I forgot to charge it. So I apologize for the, the camera quality, but it, I'll do better next time. Okay, next up, we're still hitting those hamstrings hard. That's the focus of this workout. So we have barbell stiff leg 
Beast Stance Deadlifts. I know that was a lot to take in, but just bear with me. Um, the Beast Stance portion is when you stagger your legs and you're doing the, RD, the traditional RDL version. And what that does is put extra emphasis on one leg, which of course is greater taxation on it. And then we supersetted that with single leg dumbbell RDLs, which incorporates a lot of stability and core work, as well as hitting those hamstrings even more. In performing these, I would say try to drive your belly button into your core more. That way you'll stay on balance. It'll help engage your core, which will keep you stable throughout this movement. Also, try not to let your foot touch the ground as much as possible. You want to put as much emphasis on core work as possible while also working your legs in this one. Next up, we have the leg press. Now, this particular variant of the leg press is putting emphasis on the hamstrings. And what you wanna do here is bring your feet high to the top of the platform. Don't worry, it's still stable, it's still safe. And if you feel like it's gonna slip, you can always bring your feet down a little bit, but you want to make sure that they're higher up so that you're putting more emphasis on the hamstring and taking the quad out as much as possible. I told y'all, I told y'all he's gonna be on some BS, man. Ooh, man, I'm talking too fast. I told y'all he's gonna be on some BS. We ain't getting it in, though. We ain't getting it in. As you can see, we continue to utilize the push for progressive overload. If you don't know what progressive overload is, it's when you have multiple sets and a single set, you add more weight to the exercise, and make the exercise more challenging.
go see Marty? <laughs> last but certainly not least we have standard hamstring curls now these are actually my favorite style of leg curls to do just because they're so taxing on the hamstrings it's ridiculous quick story one time i went into a gym and it was the first time of me trying this and I think I did maybe two reps before I fell to the ground and thought that I was going to die because I caught the craziest Charlie horse by doing these. But after my body got used to them and adjusted, they worked perfectly. And I, I love these for hamstring development. Hey, man. Hey, man. What's up, man? Cardio <laughs> time. Hey, man, how your legs feel? I mean, they good. Mine good now. Like, we had a little time. Look, look, I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. We both, we ain't finished the last, the last exercise we supposed to do. We both kind of went to talking, man. But it still was a good workout either way, you know what I mean? So, hey, look, if y'all ain't following my guy, follow my guy. Wait, hey, man, you Hey, man. Give my man a shout out. Most of y'all that follow me know who he is anyways, man. Give my man a shout out. Give my man a follow. Like and subscribe. Hit that notif that post notification button so that you know every time I upload. Um, and we out.